Okay, I've just finished completing my custom arena. It might not be that good because it's just cardboard and cardboard and wood. It has a lot of figures in there too. So this is gonna be a review on my arena and setup. So I'm gonna do the setup first. So I have all the crowd around the sides. So first we're going to start with the Koki, Koki Kingston, doing his boom drop to Cody Rhodes, Randy Orton RKOing, RKOing. John Morrison onto the um, steps. Justin Gabriel about to do 450 splash to Jack Swagger. Um, he is there. There we go. He's doing skull crushing finale to Sheamus. This is my favourite. The announced table being smashed by Triple H and Ted DiBiase. Um, Triple H, Penny Reese, Ted DiBiase through the announce table with their two little announcers. And then you got Stone Cold doing the stunner to R Truth. While well, Shonda Slammed about to be delivered to Rey Mysterio. Power Punch going to MVP. Here we've got the Spear by Edge. And. He got the John Cena doing his attitude adjustment to John um, to Evan Bourne. That one was probably the most simplest because all I had to do was get him on the shoulders. And so this is my arena. I put the ring in the middle, the crowd on the outside. I did a lot of cutting, cutting and sticky taping, as you might see here. And. I had the announce table for the midget and announce table. So midgets are going to be the mostly hornsbuckles are going to be um, the announcers for every match. I'm going to do heaps of videos on this. Might even upgrade um, some. So this is my arena slash setup. First setup. So. You post a comment on which one's your favourite. My favourite is the Panagree um, for the table. And then here you got the V roll because the room is raw. And you've got my custom steps and um, the last table has WWE on the top here. And just W here if you can see it. So yeah, you post a comment on which one was your favourite, and comment, rate, subscribe for more setups. I can do them anytime.